Do you want to know one superfood that you can eat every day that can help you lose weight very fast? Stay until the end of this video and I exactly show you what that superfood is. Alright mga kwentuhan, so welcome back. So if this is your first time in my channel, so uh, please make sure to click and hit that um, subscribe button. And don't forget to hit that notification bell as well if you wanted to be healthy and fit and if you wanted to be educated as well financially. Alright? So yan, so usapan tayo nung, on ano ba yung superfood na sinasabi ko that can aid and help you lose weight faster. No? So simple lang yan siya mga kapatid. Ang yung superfood na sinasabi ko medyo ito underrated to dahil usually when it comes to losing weight ang laging sinasabi na kainin would be yung green leafy vegetables which is yung lettuce, yung mga mamahalin, broccoli, cauliflower but uh, something that um, is not being shared as well is yung mga beans no yung dry beans na sinasabi at ano yung usually underrated na sinasabi kong superfood na to dito sa atin ang tawag munggo uh, or yung mung, mung beans, no? M-U-N-G beans, so mung beans. Munggo yan siya. So, napaka-beneficial ng pagkain na to in terms of um, helping you lose weight faster dahil this uh, superfood in itself is very high in protein and fiber. So, pag samay mo yung dalawa na yan, yung protein and fiber na yan will definitely help you become satiated. Ano ibig sabihin nun? Yung, uh, yung laging, yung pakiramdam na busog, right? And syempre, kung, syempre, kung busog ka, Malamang hindi ka nakakain, correct? Hindi ka mag magkikrave, hindi ka magharap ng kahit anong pagkain because you're full. Because every time that you are full and this particular superfood that I'm talking about which is itong munggo, it produces uh, a chemical in the body that can help you become full. Ano tong chemicals na to? So itong superfood na to helps produce fullness hormones which is nakakatulong na maging busog ka for a long period of time para hindi ka na magpaulit-ulit ng pagkain which in turn will help you lose weight. Alright? So, ano yung mga fullness hormones na sinasabi ko dito? Uh, GLP-1, peptide YY, tsaka yung tinatawag na cholecystokinin. So, blah blah, nakakabul na. So, cholecystokinin. So, yan siya. Isusulat ko na lang dyan para ma... So, ito yung mga ma 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 malaman nyo. So, ito yung mga fullness hormones na nakakatulong for you to be uh, fuller for a long period of time, no? Imagine this mga mga kakwentuhan, no? A, a cup of etong boiled na munggo na to or yung mung beans will immediately give you 14 to 24 grams of protein at uh, 15 grams of fiber. So isipin niyo na lang in how beneficial it can be to your whole body if you wanted to lose weight. Okay? want to debunk or uh, contrahen in terms of myth is that sinasabi nila na yung munggo daw is uh, very much high in uric acid. And in return, uh, hindi siya nakakatulong pagating dun sa mga taong merong uh, gout arthritis o yung manataas na yung uric acid. No? Though that mung beans or munggo has very high in purine, studies shows that Eating a lot of uh, dry beans like mungo does not contribute to you having gout cancer. So, myth yan siya. So, hindi yan siya totoo, no? Alright. So, I just want to debunk that uh, knowledge dahil usually sinasabi nga bawal kumain daw ng mungo pag mataas yung uric acid. Okay. So, uh, that being said, uh, na-share ko sa inyo kung ano yung superfood. So, let me uh, share with you one simple recipe that you can do with mungo that can be healthy for you when you want to include it in your daily diet, right? So yung munggo, it's very safe that you can eat every day. So if you wanted to do this, uh, papakita ko sa inyo one simple recipe na pwede nyong gawin sa munggo, okay? So let's go ahead and go to the kitchen. Alright, so uh, mga kakwentuhan, so ito na tayo. Simulan na natin yung pagluto ng munggo, yung recipe na sinasabi ko kanina. So ito yung mga ingredients natin, um, onions, garlic, uh, smoked fish or tinapaso, pinagsama-sama ko na siya sa isang lalagyanan. Uh, kailangan din natin ng syempre yung munggo, uh, boiled and smashed. So, yun yung ginawa ko dito. So, uh, reason behind kung bakit kailangan ismash, ini-smash ko yung munggo is because para mas mailabas na palalo yung ano, 
yung lasa niya compared sa normal lang na pinakuluan lang yung mundo. No? So here, ang ginawa naman natin dito is uh, pinagalo-halo na natin yung ingredient. Uh, nilagay natin sa isang kawali na merong uh, loric oil. Loric oil yung ginamit ko na pang gisa or pang saute. Uh, nilagyan ko din siya ng asin to, to make it a little salty. Tapos nilagyan ko din ng paminta. So yun yung mga ginamit natin dito. So isaute lang natin yan siya hanggang sa maluto yung uh, smoked fish. And once na matapos na makita nyo na, na naluto na or medyo nag-brown na yung, ano, yung smoked fish, then pwede na natin ihalo yung smash na munggo or yung boiled na munggo. Yeah. So pag nailagay nyo na lahat yan, so lagyan din ng water. Uh, lagyan din ng water yan siya. And then, uh, earlier pala habang ginigisa yung, ano, ginigisa yung uh, mga ingredients, Uh, yung fire natin is low to medium lang yung fire para hindi masunod dahil mabilis mas ma maluto yung ano yung sibuyas tsaka yung garlic so from the time na malagay mo na yung ano yung tubig with the mungo na boiled and smashed yung heat ng apoy ginawa ko ng high so para mapakuluan na siya so pakuluan natin dito so uh, nilagyan ko rin siya ng patis para magkaroon ng ibang pla ibang pa ibang alat na dito sa recipe na to. So, hintayin lang siya magkulo uh, until makuha mo yung tamang lapot dun sa gusto mo dun sa mungo, yung sabaw niya. So, for me, I think dito pinakulo ako siya ng mga about 5 to 10 minutes para ma-reduce ng maayos yung uh, tubig at makuha ko yung lapot or consistency na gusto ko dun sa sabaw. So, yan siya. So, hintayin lang hanggang sa makuha yung reduction na gusto mo dun sa uh, sabaw. Tapos, kung makikita na dito, continuous din yung, ano, yung paghalo ko, yung stir para hindi siya manikit dun sa kawali at hindi rin masunog yung mungo dun sa ilalim uh, ng kawali. No? So, yun yan siya. So, kaya continuous yung paghalo. So, after 5 to 10 minutes, nakuha ko yung proper na reduction dun sa mungo. And from there, I think natapos, natapos siya within 10 minutes na yun. Um, if you did learn something from, from this video, please um, share it also to your friends and family. And um, don't forget to hit that like button also. No? So, thank you mga friends sa panonood, mga kwentuhan. Maraming salamat. At ingat kayo palagi.